My name is Juan Alzate, and uh, I am the Luminous Healer. Primarily, I work with shamanic technologies to bring harmony to people's lives. Uh, that looks like assisting people in uh, focusing on an intention and aligning it to either of two directions. One is to release and let go a challenge in your life and the other path is to bring in and feed and nurture something in your life. So through this methodology I can help a person really narrow down uh, to what is most important in their life and allow them to have that moment of clarity to move forward and really embrace all the lessons of their life. At my healing center, I first sit down with a client to discuss the unique challenges they are facing. Together, we formulate an intention for the healing session. The client chooses a stone from my mesa, which is a healing bundle of sacred objects I have accumulated through my shamanic initiations and training. The stone is like an empty magnet we can program with our breath, our life force. The client focuses on their intention and using the breath, life force energy transmits into the sacred stone. Once we program the stone with the intention, we move to the table to scan the energy body and perform the healing work. The stone is placed on the affected chakra in order to process and release energy through it and into the stone. Through guidance, breath, intention, and various techniques, we're able to clear that central energy channel, heal the chakras, and bring balance to a person's life. Once the session is complete, we reconnect client to Mother Earth, allow them to viscerally, energetically, emotionally, whole bodily be connected to Mother Earth. We're able to complete the session by reconnecting the client to the sun, to the creator, to that source of all life. Through the process, the client returns to a state of peace, connection, and deep clarity. When I got on the table, I was able to feel this sunlight, this illumination, this life-giving energy that pour into my solar plexus. I really was able to connect with that stone and I felt the energy really moving through my body and everything was letting go and releasing. and. That really allowed me to connect with myself while I was on the table. I was able to bring in that inner strength, that inner fortitude to give myself the clarity and peace of mind and see clearly what I want to be doing and bringing into my life. The illumination is like resetting yourself back to that original self and um, from there there's three other sessions uh, there's extractions where after we get a clarity we could patch up any holes or leaks in our energy field pulling out other people's energy and energy that isn't ours then there's soul retrieval one of my personal favorites where we're able to now that we're clear and we're not connected to others and we're just really ourselves, we can really go into this vulnerable, uh, unconscious, subconscious place where we can let go of ancient traumas. They could span from lifetimes ago or just earlier in this lifetime, releasing its grip on us, bringing back whatever part of our soul was lost in that event, and coming back to fullness. Um, and the final session, uh, which is destiny retrieval is about completing this cycle of transformation 
and feeding that destiny, right? Once I am fully here, then I can fully be present to all of that I am and all of that has brought me here. So we go to this higher place of the eagle, of the condor, where we see the big picture, where we connect to the great tone that brought us here and uh, start living in the present moment, embodying all of ourselves.